Hey guys, um, Chimera Cuba 25 here with my first um, Halo uh, Mega Blocks review. Here's a kitten that wants down. And her eyes are all messed up. Give me a minute while I clean out her eyes. That's not better. Anyway, my last video, if you haven't seen it, is just shooting around on my Fur Vulcan, which I'm taking back tomorrow because it's a piece of crap. Anyway, this is on the Rocket Warthog from the new line of Halo Wars, of Halo, uh, Thing Medus, Mega Blocks. First, we're going to go over the minifigures. Go over the Elite first. Here's the elite. Yeah, that'll happen. Um, overall pretty nice. Wonderful detail. Um, a lot better than Lego. Seriously, Lego, why can't you do this? Seriously. Wee. And he comes with. And one energy sword. So, pop that in his hand. Shut up. And it looks pretty kick ass with it. So, have an elite. Now, for the cool ones. It's these Spartans you get are two white camo Spartans that are exactly the same. Except for the grace um, blotches all over the suit that make them camo. Those just randomized. As you can see, um, this one on the side of his visor. There's a lot of gray right there. I'm not sure if you can see that. If you look on this one, there's no gray. And it just varies around the armor, whether there's gray or not. That's with all these white camo ones that come in the set. And which, what really sucks about this set that I didn't like, I just dropped one. So that really sucks about this set is the only guns you get are two magnums. One for both Spartans. Essentially the same thing. Nice detailing. My webcam is going to pick it up, but it's you know, overall nice. My tummy car! They hold them pretty nice, pretty good. So this is my leader. He's pretty cool. My first set, but I will be getting three more tomorrow. Two of them are twenty and thirty dollars. I remember they're probably both thirty dollars. I don't know. And one's like ten dollars. So there you go. Let's go to the vehicles now. Okay, so three mini figs. Mini figures. Cool. So here's uh the Wraith or the Wraith, the ghost, sorry. I'll be getting that set tomorrow. Overall looks really nice. It's um almost all sets have uh, a camo brick gimmick. If it's a flying or a floating kind of vehicle. You have that to kind of give the illusion of it's floating. Ooh, cheap gimmickry. Eh, it's cool. And the elite stands on that little shit. He, he cannot stay on here very well. If you want him to have both handles on the handlebars, he can't. They won't let you. That's probably one on the box, which I don't have with me right now. I'm sorry. Oh no, I can go get it real quick. But, uh, yay. Now I'm going to turn this light on. You can see a little bit better. Yeah, it's a lot better. Take a look at these Spartans for a minute and take in their awesomenessity. It's not even a word.
spend that two dollars to turn on that. Yep. different picture of the Spartan from Halo Wars. It's not called Halo Wars, it's just called Halo now. Which is cool. Um, picture of everything. Nothing too special. Bloody bloody blah blah blah. Blah bloody bloody blah, blah. The back's pretty cool, I guess. Whatever. Alright, let's get into the main part of the set, the uh, Arctic or Rocket Warthog. Um, keep in mind, um, it does have some hydraulics, as you can see back here. But um, look on the other side. Yeah, the front wheel. This one. It doesn't hydraulic. You have to push it down. The reason for that is because I lost one of these. That was gross. One of these connectors. These are the Mega Blocks connectors. And I had to use one from a Von Nebula from Bionicle. That's why, and it's a lot tighter. No, it's cheap. So it's pretty strong. Yes, I do have um, two Hero Factory sets, Duncan Bulk and Von Nebula. Um, so, yeah, and this antenna, it always falls off. It goes in the right back here. Okay, so, this guy's my driver. Just pop him in there. And then grab the steering wheel only with one hand, of course, because the other hands don't reach. The hand won't reach. Sorry. And you can even have this one. Do you like in Halo where he can sit in the front and poke his head out and use his gun and shoot? Shoot some fools. You fool. Bam. Or you can get into the rocket turret. Um, in the back, like warthogs are known for having uh, having turrets in the back. Unlike the Target exclusive uh, troop carrier warthog, it just has a big cage in the back. Carrying troops, obviously. There you go. Have him in the back. We already. So overall, a really nice set. I highly recommend it. It was about. Roughly, I don't know, 20 bucks. And there's a big cat right here. <laughs> um, thank you. Yeah. Eagle, eagle, eagle. Apparently, I'm going to be petting her now. <laughs> Oh man, that's funny. <laughs> um, if I just farted right there. If you didn't know that, I did that on purpose. <laughs> Let's just see what you. I can't wait to see the comments. I'm so excited! Yay! <laughs> okay. And she walks in front of the shot again. You should be on the desk and stop sitting on the box. Ah, thank you. And this little one's gonna get up here and say hello to all, to all y'all, real quick. Or just walk around, sniffing the Arctic Warthog. 
almost looking at the camera. Look at the camera. Say, Hello, I'm cute. I'm slightly cross-eyed. Wow. Mow, mow, goes the kitty cats. Pretty tasticness. That's what I like to see. Okay, so, go through what you get one more time. You get, um, a kitten. Just kidding. You get two. I should get out of the way. Two white Spartans. Arctic or Rocket Warthog. Um, one Elite with an Energy Sword and a Ghost. And two Magnum. Now tomorrow, I'll be getting up early, early, early in the morning to go to an all-you-can-eat breakfast buffet. I'm going to eat like three small little pancakes and be full. I always do. And, um, uh, yeah. And meow. And then I'll be going to Walmart to pick up the Wraith set because it comes with Hayabusa. Um, and because the Wraith's pretty cool. And the White Elite's awesome. So I can get a Second, uh, thing we do. Energy sword. And, uh, then, uh, the katana. The katana. It's pretty cool. Then I'll be getting at the, at that Walmart. I'll be getting the mongoose. For my first green. This is my only set that I have so far. To get my first green, uh, Spartan. And for the sniper rifle. And the mongoose looks pretty easy to build. Uh, the turret will be, that'll probably be the first one to build, so it'll be pretty easy. And my next one, I'll be going to Target to get the Target exclusive Hornet, because that comes with the Red Hayabusa. Um, a really cool pilot that doesn't look so doofy and has like a half helmet showing his chin and stuff. It looks so stupid. And it looks like an ODS, a red ODST, so it's pretty cool. Um, Red Hayabusa, like I said, another, you get another Katana. You get a Magnum, uh, a Jackal, Beam Rifle, not Beam Rifle, uh, Carbine, the Red Hornet, that's uh, my favorite vehicle, and the Whatchamadu, the Covenant Platform, so I will be getting all that tomorrow. What, um, half of it I will be getting with the money of the Vulcan that I'm returning, and my mom's so nice that she decided to give me some extra money to get to pay the extra five dollars for the mongoose and pay completely for the hornet so it's pretty awesome okay so hope you enjoyed this review more coming soon as in tomorrow let's do that reviews coming soon and kittens are awesome she's like I was asleep you douche <laughs> the box fell in her This is giblet. This video went on way too long. Okay, goodbye.